Hi everyone, David Jackson here, slingandstonemarketing.com, and in this video, I'm going to cover KPIs or key performance indicators. So let's first start by breaking down this term. You have key, which is something that is of great importance to your business as it relates to moving it forward to achieving the goals that you have set for it, whether that be sales or revenue or anything else that you choose it to be. Then you have performance, which is a measurement of how well or poorly something is doing. And lastly is indicator, which is a marker or a form of measurement that is specific so that you can compare it to previous times before. So how are KPIs used in business and marketing? Well, they provide a way of giving you a snapshot of how well certain as aspects of your business and marketing are doing, whether it be year over year, month over month, or week over week. For example, if you have an ad campaign running and one of your KPIs is the number of sales or leads that the ad is generating, that will help you determine whether or not you should pour more money into the ad campaign or if you should turn it off and make some tweaks to it so that it can perform better. But one thing to look out for is calling something a KPI that is not. So things such as likes, shares, comments, traffic, or even search engine rankings are not KPIs. While they can be measured and tracked, and there might even be a correlation between those metrics and how your business is performing, they are not directly related to business goals such as sales or revenue. Instead, KPIs should be things like customer acquisition costs, conversion rate, the number of sales or leads that you're generating. These are things that have a direct impact on profitability. Now I plan on doing videos in the future that will go more in depth on certain KPIs and how you can improve them. So to make sure that you don't miss out on those, click the subscribe button below and if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. It will give me an opportunity to help others. And if you have any questions, comments, or topics that you want me to cover in future videos, leave it in the comments section below. I thank you for taking your time to watch this, and I will see you in the next video.